So you might be having an issue where your Samsung TV is not connecting to your Wi-Fi connection. Now this can happen for a few different reasons. The very first thing I would recommend doing though is making sure that you're typing in the credentials of your Wi-Fi connection completely properly. Whether you're typing it in, you know, the password kind of right or kind of wrong, just make sure you're typing it in 100% correct. And as long as you can verify that that is the case, then usually you should be good to go. I have been in so many situations where so many different devices I've had had some sort of internet connection problem. And as long as I typed it in correctly, I can at least verify that at, at the very least, my Wi-Fi connection and my TV is probably not the issue. So what I'd recommend doing here is if you're typing it in right and it's still not working, the next thing I'd recommend doing is completely powering down your Samsung TV and powering it back on and seeing if, you know, going through the same exact process and take a look and see if that ends up fixing it. Sometimes that probably will fix it, sometimes it won't. You can also try completely unplugging your TV, plugging it back in, and seeing if that in and of itself also fixes the situation. Again, it's not a guarantee, but it's one of those other things you can try doing. Now, if that still doesn't work, another thing you can try doing is going through and pretty much restarting your Wi-Fi router. So go through, you can either, you know, restart your Wi-Fi router normally however you would do it, and then go and power back on and try reconnecting to that Wi-Fi router. Again, it's not a guarantee, but it's another one of those things you can try doing, and sometimes that's probably all you have to do. Now, if that still doesn't work, the Wi-Fi router might be the problem. So if you can, either, you know, your Samsung TV may have an Ethernet port. If you're able to, you know, wi if you're able to get an Ethernet port inside of it, you know, connect it to it and see if you can update your actual TV. Sometimes there might be a TV available or, you know, update available. So go through, update your TV, and that might end up fixing the situation as well. So those are a few different ways to fix it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.